by washing our hands, we are really going to eradicate those diseases that can be caused by um, <laughs> by not washing your hands. Yes. It's okay. I am. I'm Margaret Ombuya. I'm 51 years old. I'm a teacher by profession. Do I look at you or at the camera? The camera. camera. Okay. Um, my name is Jabrail Teja. I am 25, 26 this month actually, and I'm an accountant. <laughs> My name is Asim Sharma. Okay, let me do that again. My name is Asim Sharma. I'm 28 years old. I'm an actress on a, a re, um, I'm a regular on a national television series, and I'm also a yoga instructor. Hi, I am Alikhan Suratia. I am an actor, radio presenter, and a model. So my name is Medina Khan, and uh, I am. <laughs> I am a director of business development in the IT industry. My name is Martin Muirore Wainena. My name is Claire Baker. My name is Eric Omondi. I am a fundraising and communications consultant. And I'm a assessment stroke uh, mansion trainers. I'm a professional studio photographer. At the moment, what I'm working on is research. I wash my hands at least 10 times a day, like no matter what I touch. If I can't, uh, if I can't wash my hands, I sanitize. But about 10 times a day at least. I would say every time someone comes into the room, I feel the need to wash my hands because I like to interact physically with people and I wouldn't like to make them as unsafe. Well, I wash my hands a lot more probably than I used to. Um, and I make sure every time I come home, if I leave the house, every time I come home, first thing I do is wash my hands before I touch everything else. Uh, before the COVID-19 pandemic, I didn't wash my hands regularly. Yeah, unlike unlike now. Ooh, maybe 10 to 15 times, I would think. Maybe, maybe that much? No, I wouldn't say 15 is on the high end. Maybe, maybe we'll, let's, let's stick with 10. <laughs> uh, when I'm at work, uh, I don't like wash my hands so regularly because you find there are customers like coming like just next after next. So you, you, you don't have that time to like do your hands, so you use the sanitizer instead. I am an obsessive hand washer. I, if I'm cooking, I can probably wash my hands in the space of cooking one dinner about 15 times. Uh, my family and I wash our hands on average close to about now, you could say about 20 to 30 times a day. In comparison to before, where it'd probably be about six times a day, you've gotten to the point where your hands are literally sparkling clean. <laughs> Your hands are not clean, and especially when the dirt gets underneath your nails, you know? Uh-uh. <laughs> I've realized that men don't like washing their hands. I've been observing, especially after visiting the toilet, you find that they just move out and go. But because of COVID, they are now adhering to that. You underestimate how many germs there are on your hands. You, you don't realize it. How many surfaces you touch in a day that could actually have bacteria, you know that now because of COVID. So you're very aware what you're touching, how often you're touching, and after that, how often you're touching your face. <laughs> and I saw a video where they say you have to do the thumbs as well, so they do that, and just this, because I was reading a lot. <laughs> and I would see flyers everywhere, especially in hospitals and you know malls on how to wash your hands, so I followed that and then just rinse them under the running water. People are very big on sanitizing their hands, but really, if you follow the guidelines on using soap when you wash your hands, if you do it properly, it's even more effective than sanitizer. Because sanitizer, it has to be 70% alcohol to work on COVID. And a lot of the time, if you look at most of the bottles that are being sold, they don't even say if there's 70% alcohol. So I prefer to rely on hand washing rather than the sanitizer. What advice I would give is uh, make a conscious effort to at least have a certain amount of times you wash your hands irrespective of what you touch. And not only washing, we must do it in the correct way, using the steps that you've been advised by the health, health what? Ministry. Ministry is, yeah. What is it called again, sir? 
Sand to tap. Sand to tap. It's actually really brilliant because right now we live in the new norm. So the new handshake is this. So right now to start washing your hands, this is the new norm. On, off. Brilliant.